Hey people, it's Larry again. Surprise, surprise, that was a quick uh, turnaround between videos. I'm going to show you something here real quick. I just warmed up my fish tank earlier today. I got my water in my system at 73.3 degrees. That was after running my stove out here for four hours to bring it up from it was right at 66.1 degrees when I came out here. So four hours I got it up that high. It shut off an hour and a half ago. My temperature in the room right now, we can get focused in on this. Maybe you're not. 65.5 degrees. All right. We have this little thermometer here little digital meat thermometer. We're going to take this over here to the sump and we're going to put this in the tube here. This is my return line from my towers. Seventy one point five degrees. So you can do the math there, 73.3 degrees in the fish tank, 71.5 degrees after the water passes through the towers, picking up, yeah, well I, I should say actually losing their heat to the room. Uh, so if you have any questions about you know, the total cost of ownership of towers, whether you build these or you buy the the zip grows or if you build the other type of towers that use the cups and the little net pots just keep in mind uh, you're going to have to have some deep pockets if you think that you're going to do a huge production you know lots and lots of produce because you're growing vertically and utilizing your volume rather than uh, simply your square foot area now keep in mind, I have 10 towers here and 350 gallons of water. If you have 100 towers and 3,000 gallons of water, you're going to spend a lot more money to heat that water and you're going to lose a lot more of that heat. Again, it comes down to total cost of ownership. Don't be snowballed by good marketing schemes. If, you, if they aren't telling you the entire story, like any negative aspects whatsoever, take your money and run. So right there's some real-time proof of, what, of the point I was trying to make. Nope, I'm not saying that you should not use towers, period. I'm saying don't use them exclusively. And don't be, you know, don't let someone bullshit you into thinking that you're going to put a few of these towers up and just make money hand over fist on, you know, large volume production. That production is going to come at a cost. Uh, so if that's the route that you are really set on going, have some deep pockets before, you know, uh, you, you set your mind to it because you're going to need really deep pockets. That's all. Thanks again. Bye.